Corinthian Rishon, 1 Corinthians 10. Moreover, brethren, I would not that ye should be ignorant how that all our fathers were under the cloud and all passed through the sea and were all immersed unto Moshe in the cloud and in the sea and did all eat the same spiritual meat and did all drink the same spiritual drink. For they drank of that spiritual rock that followed them. And that rock was Hamashiach. But with many of them, Yahweh was not well pleased. For they were overthrown in the wilderness. Now these things were our examples. To the intent we should not lust after evil things as they also lusted. Neither be ye idolaters, as were some of them. As it is written, the people sat down to eat and drink, and rose up to play. Neither let us commit fornication, as some of them committed, and fell in one day three and twenty thousand. Neither let us tempt Hamashiach, as some of them also tempted at Yahweh, and were destroyed of serpents. Neither murmur ye, as some of them also murmured, and were destroyed of the destroyer. Now all these things happened unto them for examples, and they are written for our admonition, upon whom the ends of the world are come. Wherefore, let him that thinks he stands take heed lest he fall. There has no temptation taken you, but such as is common to man. But Yahweh is faithful, who will not suffer you to be tempted above that ye are able, but will with the temptation also make a way to escape that ye may be able to bear it. Wherefore, my dearly beloved, Flee from idolatry. I speak as to wise men. Judge ye at what I say. The cup of blessing which we bless, is it not the fellowship of the blood of Hamashiach? The bread which we break, is it not the fellowship of the body of Hamashiach? For we being many are one bread and one body. For we are all partakers of that one bread. Behold, Yahshadael, after the flesh, are not they which eat of the sacrifices partakers of the altar? What say I then, that the idol is anything, or that which is offered in sacrifice to idols is anything? But I say that the things which the other nations sacrifice, they sacrifice to devils and not to Yahweh. And I would not that ye should have fellowship with devils. Ye cannot drink the cup of Yah and the cup of devils. Ye cannot be partakers of Yahweh's table and of the table of devils. Do we provoke at Yahweh to jealousy? Are we stronger than he? All things are powerful for me. But all things are not profitable. All things are powerful for me, but all things edify not. Let no man seek his own, but every one, rather, man, another's wealth. Whatsoever is sold in the market, that eat, asking no question for conscience' sake. For the earth is Yahweh's, and the fullness thereof. If any of them that believe not bid you to a feast, and ye be disposed to go, whatsoever is set before you eat, asking no question for conscience' sake. But if any man say unto you, This is offered in sacrifice unto idols, eat not for his sake that showed it, and for conscience' sake. For the earth is Yahweh's, and the fullness thereof. Conscience, I say, not your own, but of the other. 
For why is my liberty judged of another man's conscience? For if I by grace be a partaker, why am I evil spoken of for that for which I give thanks? Whether therefore ye eat or drink, or whatsoever ye do, do all to the glory of Yahweh. Give none offense, neither to the Yahudim, nor to the other nations, nor to the called out assembly of Yahweh, even as I please all men in all things, not seeking my own profit, but the profit of many, that they may be saved.